Uh, hi there. Uh, my name is Brandon Ward. Um, I'm a resident of the Saxonville neighborhood of Framingham, um, and I, uh, I grew up in Framingham. I picked uh, Hoops and Homework as a charity I'm going to fundraise for uh, because I care a lot uh, about giving uh, equitable access to opportunity um, and access to education. Um, growing up, I always worked at summer camps and after school programs, uh, and specifically on the south side of Framingham at a suburban athletic club. Um, and so I, I care a lot about uh, giving everyone a positive uh, uh, and productive uh, environment that they can go to after school um, to, uh, to have fun and just be successful. Um, so why am I running the marathon? Um, I have been someone who always uh, enjoys being active. I uh, love to hike. I always played soccer growing up. Um, and I do, uh, I do enjoy running. I've never run a marathon. Uh, so Boston Marathon is going to be my first marathon. Um, but I've done uh, my fair share of 5Ks and even a couple of half marathons. So I'm particularly interested in, in fundraising for Hoops and Homework. Um, having grown, uh, grown up in Framingham, I think Framingham is a community that I care about. When I bought a home on uh, Central Street in Framingham two years ago, uh, me and my wife were really intentional about wanting to come to Framingham. Uh, because I think it's a really great community, uh, but I think it still struggles with something that a lot of communities in our country struggle with, which is income inequality um, and just uh, uh, economic disparity. And I think uh, this is a program that is designed uh, to try to tackle that, um, maybe in just one small element or way, uh, but it's uh, a way that I care a lot about and I'm really excited to, to fundraise for uh, this year. I was lucky um, growing up, my, my family moved around a lot. I was born in Indiana and South Carolina before we came to Framingham. Um, and when we came to Framingham, I really was lucky to find a community that really supported me. Um, I still distinctly remember my elementary school teachers in fourth grade, Mrs. Dudakalis and fifth grade, Mr. Fair, who um, were just incredibly instrumental in helping me be successful. And I, I found, had a love for soccer uh, as well as basketball. Um, and a real love for reading that um, I think helped me uh, stay on the right path, but it would, could have been really easy to, to stray from that. And so, um, and then just working at Suburban Athletic Club growing up, seeing uh, or giving kids the opportunity to have a positive release um, and frankly, just uh, uh, adult supervision and daycare uh, as, as opposed to going home and, uh, and being by themselves something that I did have to do uh, with a mom who was working two jobs uh, and a stepdad who was around at times, but um, it just I, 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 an opportunity for kids to, to, uh, to, to spend time in a positive environment is something that I'm, uh, I believe a lot in.